Hello, hello, hello. How's it going? It's Marky. I'm opening up a bunch of new Hot Wheels I picked up this week. If you want to help the channel, please leave a comment and uh, say hello in the comments. Let me know which ones you bought lately. It really helps a lot if you guys leave a message. I picked up this nice Nissan. Look at this. The Nissan Leaf Nismo RC02. So happy that I found this. Finally, some more uh, D-Case, by the way. These are all D-Case finds. Well, not all of them. I did I did pick up, pick up a... Well, I'll show you now in a second. But I got a bunch of D-Case cards that I had not found yet. Man, we are running behind in my area. Only We're only up to D-Case so far. And uh, never saw B-Case at all. So I've never seen B-Case yet. I know there's probably a bunch of carryovers on B in in uh, B case, but you know, hoping to find B case sometime soon. I'm sure it'll it'll show up. They're kind of like arriving out of order. We got some more older cases in uh, last week and this week, so it's been very frustrating to see a bunch of C case again and uh, some A case cars again. But um, here we go, Nissan, looking really good in red. I love it. Really, really nice. And I also picked up, let me see. This one is the Mustang, the Mach-E 1400 Ford Mustang in a really nice new color. Hadn't seen this one yet, so finally got it. It's another uh, D case car. Hot Wheels Drag Strip Series. This is pretty cool. I think uh, these two would make a nice uh, pair to race on the track. Look at that. Pretty nice. Pretty nice to have these two uh, beautiful Hot Wheels in the collection now. Very nice. Man, so sweet to find new ones. Very exciting. Let me know what you found lately. I also picked up the Time of Taxi. And it does have the special feature, which is like an opening door. It's celebrating the Year of the Rabbit for China. The Year of the Rabbit this year in China. Happy Year of the Rabbit if you're in China. And let's see. There it is. It's got like an opening door. I don't know. It's kind of like a plastic piece there. So it snaps in place. Pretty nice. These little tri-wheels look pretty cool. And there's the, the little symbols. I guess they say Year of the Rabbit. There's the rabbit right there. Hot Wheels. And number 23 on the top. Time a taxi. I like this color. They did it in a really nice red with the with the yellow and black or black and yellow graphics. Just look really cool and the gold on the wheels. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. Year of the rabbit car. And uh, got some of my older finds uh, back there. I did pick up an extra Mazda 787B. Which I'm happy to get. I'm going to open this one to have one to race. Here's my other one that I have found previously. So now I have an extra. I want to put one on the track and uh, beat him up. <laughs> so I'm going to have a nice one. And I found another uh, Pagani. The Zonda R. So I picked this one up. I already opened it up. I do have one already in the collection, which is back here. So now I'll have uh, two of them. One to destroy jumping crashing and all that good stuff let me put him back in the package i'll see which one i want to make the uh the one to play with and which one i'm gonna keep on the on the uh in the bat in the uh, what do you call it in the uh, case with all the other cars from from that case here's the midnight auto i finally found this one i had found this one uh previously over here uh from this series so i finally got another one this one the first one i found was the fandango and this one over here now is the Midnight Auto. It looks really cool. It does have the uh, WB characters on there. Just like on the card. You can see them right here on the side. Really cool. It says 100 years of Warner Brothers right there on a black stripe on the back there. Big, taller wheels in the back. Smaller ones in the front with the gold five spokes. Really nice. The Midnight Auto looks really good in this bright or lighter blue color. And we do have the... Uh, the pipes showing there on the sides in chrome and then the gold chrome on the wheels looking pretty cool the midnight auto huh 
Copyright 2001, Mattel. Pretty cool little hot rod. Happy to get this one. So now I have two from this series. Still got to find the van, which I really want to find. And hopefully the mystery machine or kind of two that I'm hoping to find soon. We did get an A case in town at Walmart. And look at this. They had the uh, Pontiac GTO 2006. And I think I needed this one. I don't know. I might have it already in the collection, but I'm not sure. So I just bought one just in case because I, I had a feeling that maybe I missed this one. But I might be wrong. I just might have forgotten that I have it. And uh, my initial preview look around, I didn't see it. So it might be a good thing that I picked it up. <laughs> and there's his first crash as he joins the collection. And I got the new 86 Toyota Van Recolor Japan Imports series. I hadn't even run, run into uh, this one yet until yesterday. I got this one yesterday, actually last night. So... First time I see him in this uh, combo, it looks pretty cool. It looks very 70s with the brown, orange, and red stripes, kind of like the rainbow, kind of, kind of like the uh, rainbow in the in the brown fall tone colors. Pretty nice, pretty nice. I got the uh, red Toyota van as well, and I think this is another one in a different color. I can't remember now if it was silver. Maybe it was silver or a grayish color. I think I got one like that too. This one does come. With the uh, smoky windows and the window on top. I mean the sunroof there. Uh, mirrors on the side which are really cool. And the bumper is in brown. And a little spoiler in black on the front under that bumper. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Looks pretty good. I like the uh, Toyota name back there. Hot Wheels on the license plate. And the Toyota name on the front. I don't know if that's a plate or just like the... Uh, kind of like the grill. Very nice, very nice. Does have the little wing in the back and the disc wheels in chrome. Very cool. The 1986 Toyota van. So another addition to the collection. And I found this. Look at this. Look at this. The 1988 Jeep Wagoneer. Looking really cool in gray. Two-tone with the uh, black on the bottom half. Very cool. Let's get them out of the package. From the 80s collection. I like this. The uh, Hot Wheels, the 80s series. Pretty cool. It's like a gray enamel color. The Jeep. Looking good. It's got the all, all black grill in front. Oh no. Why did I not check? It's got some damage here. Look at that. Looks like he had a fender bender. More like a bumper bender. <laughs> He's got a bumper bender back there. Oh my God. How did I not see that? They did have another one of these. Just one more. I could have gotten the good one. 2022 Motel. I bet you if I stop by there tonight, they won't have any. <laughs> oh, man. What a bummer. Well, guess which one's going into the uh, pile to play heavy with. <laughs> You'll get some action. Let's see. The 67 Jeepster Commando in a new color as well. Another D case find. Very cool. I love the uh, the color on this one. It looks pretty nice for a Jeep. Hot Wheels Hot Truck Series. It's got the little kind of like a chrome or grayish color on the star in the middle of the wheel there. And then this looks like kind of like a map of the terrain. We do have a motorcycle back there. Very cool. I did find this one in like a blue color not long ago which was like a really old case that popped up or something. I don't know. Some really old cars that popped up popped, popped up at Target. I'm going to say Pop-Tarts any second. Look at the uh, mirrors on the side there. One on this side, one on that side. Little lights on top, little rack up there. Kind of like a sunroof. I don't know, or it's just like a see-through rack, rack up there. It's so cool. Looks pretty nice. It is a left-side drive. Two-seater. Cool motorcycle in the back. Pretty uh, fun looking Jeep. Very, very nice. So, so far I picked up some pretty cool cars for the year. I just, it's just been like a really slow, um, slow uh, collecting kind of beginning of the year because man, we're, we keep getting repeats of the same cases over and over and over. I, 
I don't even want to film the uh, peg hunts because uh, uh, we keep getting the same ones. Now, this one, I left a bunch on the pegs. There was like three when I found this one weeks ago, and I have not seen it ever since. And I wanted to uh, get another one. So I'm hoping I find another one of this, a uh, Savannah, because I would like to have one to uh, crash and stuff. The Mazda, 89 Mazda Savannah RX-7. Loving it in the green color. Looking really cool. Yeah, I need to get one more. And so I'm happy to have that one, though. And this really cool Mustang. I did pick up an extra of the Mustang recently. I was lucky to find it again because I had left some on the pegs. I had only bought the one. Big fat tires in the back. 84 Mustang SVO. Yeah, really nice. Really nice to have this one in the collection. And then I have the Elvija or Elvija. Nope, I'm sorry. Rimac. Rimac Nevera. I don't know. There it is. Sorry, I was pointing the other way. Rimac, Nevera. My bad, my bad. Calling it the uh, Vijack. They're the same color and they're new to me. Two, both cars are new to me. Not used to them. They kind of look very similar. Nice wing in the back. Pretty nice color too. This is very unusual. This plastic piece here goes all the way up here. And all the way up there. See that? It's part of the base. Do you have this one already in your collection? This is, uh, I think it was from, yeah, from DK's, right? And then we have the Track Pursuit, is what it says on the side, but it's, it's the, um, the Dodge, right? Let me see. Dodge Charger Drift, yeah. So cool. I love that big Hot Wheels logo on the door. It looks so cool. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Uh, we are missing the mirrors on the side on this Dodge. And then we saw this one already and this one. I also have this nice Corvette, which I had picked up a couple weeks ago. And, um, hmm. Corvette C7Z06 convertible. I wonder what the next color on the uh, Corvette is going to be. This is a pretty nice combo. I like it. Looks really good. Is it the same color? Yeah, they look very similar, right? Right? They look like the same color. This one, oh my God, what am I doing? The Mercedes Benz 300 SL. This is the Super Treasure Hunt. Not this one, but this is the casting that you can find as a Super. I can't wait to find another Super. I've only, have only found one Super so far in my uh, collecting lifetime. All the other ones I have, I've had to buy or got them in trades or such, something, you know, stuff like that. But, uh, yeah, <laughs> I found the uh, Audi Super, which was really exciting. And uh, here we have the nice Bentley in the new green color the first one issued was a green but it was a brighter green the first bentley ever i was showing in the video yesterday that i have the 2020 release of the bentley i think it was a 2020 and this one has a long name let's check out the name on this thunderbird ah they didn't even put it on there just ford thunderbird okay cool 1988 ford thunderbird yeah i can't remember the name by heart but uh it's a long name. Pretty cool. Did you find this one? Are you going to collect it? The last one was pink. Now we got the white one. And okay, there it is the other, uh, the Fandango. WB celebration of 100 years. By the way, guys, I was going to mention that uh, the other day I showed this Tony Hawk skateboard from Hot Wheels. It's one of the main lines. And I forgot to mention that. Pop! You can pop him off. <laughs> He comes right off the skateboard, in case you didn't know that, just want to let you know. And you can switch him if you want to go the other way or you're filming something or whatever and you need him to, to look the other way, you can do that as well. And he'll look that way. So pretty cool. I think it's a nice feature that he comes off and you can do that. Thought I'd mention that. I also picked up not long ago the 300. Did I get it right? Is it the 300? Nah, Nissan Z. Man, what am I talking about the 300? I am so off my game today, guys. <laughs> I hope you still enjoy the video and leave me a like and a comment. Let me know how your collecting is coming along.
Man, the comments help so much. My videos are not really getting pushed out there. No likes, no comments. Guys, I need your help big time. If you're uh, still here, please uh, don't forget to comment and like on the video. You can just comment anything. <laughs> you want to <laughs> comment the word save. I'm saving your channel. Just put S-A-V-E. Put the word save in the comments and I know, I'll know why you're commenting. Thank you, man. I really appreciate it. There's the Lucid in uh, gold. Do have the other one, the uh, silver one. And can't remember the name of this one. Tesla Y, is it? Tesla Model Y, yeah. Four-door Tesla. I've gotten this one. I haven't seen it ever since. There's, hasn't been many around. Man, Hot Wheels in my town. I don't know. They've been drying up fast. The brick-in delivery. And, uh, you know, we do get... Hot Wheels every week, but they're always the same cases over and over. And we've got this one. A sm uh, small block, which is pretty cool. And got this uh, strange car. <laughs> this is the uh, dual, what was it called? Oh, twin duction. Twin duction. The twin duction double engines, it looks like. There you see the double exhaust pipes on the side there and here's another strange one the sublime oh my god nope group c group c fantasy i was gonna call it the uh, sublime which i had here somewhere turbine sublime right there yeah man i'm i'm just not getting nothing's working guys my memory is not working i'm just not feeling 100% today. I don't know what's going on. But here we go. I do have to uh, stop by the store and buy some cough syrup and maybe some airborne because I feel like maybe I'm going to catch something. Very cool. The low lux in the new color. I did get this one. I got the Barbie extra in the white. Which looks really cool. I have the silver and I have the other one. It's been like, I think this is the third color. And, of course, I can't remember the other one. Here's another fantasy car that looks kind of like a muscle car. The Count Muscula. Big giant wing in the back. And the number 55. Pretty cool. This one I have seen a few times. The Eric and Steinrod. And the new uh, blue colors, the race team colors. I like how it looks. And the Gotta Go in yellow. I got the blue one, which was a treasure hunt. And now I got this yellow one. The Gotta Go. <laughs> I did get this little hot chicken truck. <laughs> the Ice Cream King. Nope, the Quick Bite. The Ice Cream King is uh, the Matchbox one. The Quick Bite. Hot Chicken. There's a treasure hunt that I got that's kind of like this color. Very similar. I thought it was the treasure hunt at first. I was like, oh, I got that one as a treasure hunt. But no, it's the hot chicken. And here's the warp hot wired warp speeder. Oh my God. What is wrong with me today, guys? <laughs> Don't forget, give me a like on the video, guys. And comment something. The word save. Try to save my channel, guys, from doom. As I can tell that uh, from my analytics, I'm not getting shared that much anymore. Not getting enough likes or any comments, no interaction. And this one's the Volvo P1800, 1800 gasser. Awesome. Also got this one not too long ago from the Art Car series, the Hot Wheels Ford Transit Connect. And I got another uh, bone shaker in black. Now this one, they do leave behind a lot. I see a lot of bone shakers left hanging out. The bone shaker so they'll have the ones from the previous shipment and then they'll have some more from the next shipment and the next shipment they're starting to, starting to pile up at target <laughs> and then i got the head gasket in the new blue color which i had shown previously as well a lot of these i already all these the uh, ones i got before them it's kind of like an update on everything i picked up this year the uh, clip rod so I'm showing all the new ones I got, plus some of the old ones I got, in case you haven't seen these up close. The roller toaster. Now, this one's an error card car, I mean. It came with the fat wheels in the front and the small wheels in the back. So these don't move because they shoved them in there. And I didn't notice until I opened the box. I wish I had, 
I mean, the uh, card. I wish I had not opened it and kept it on the card because it's such a unique thing to have an error like that. Kind of like the Batmobile that I opened up and then I realized it was unriveted. And there's another one. I can't remember. Another error I opened up and then I'm like, oh my God, an error. Oh, it was the um, one of the uh, race cars. Not the R302. Uh, I can't remember right now, but the, the, the headlights are popping out and there's no way you can push them in. They're plastic headlights. And that was another error car that I opened up, didn't realize that it was all damaged. Like totally put together the wrong way. That was riveted together with the lights not pushed in the right way. So it's kind of funny looking. It has the plastic piece, then the light sticking out. Looks really strange. I think I have it somewhere. I don't know. Not too far from here. But that's about it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the uh, checking out the new cars and the update. And please don't forget... Hit the like button, leave a comment, let me know how your collecting is going, what have you found, and what, what uh, cases have you found so far. We're up to D case. I uh, can't wait to find something new. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next video.